A 6.5 potential difference is applied between the ends of a 0.6 millimeter diameter, 90 centimeter long nichrome wire. What is the current on the wire? For this problem, we need two formulas. We need the resistance formula to know how much resistance is on the wire. So the resistance formula is R, wait, R equals P L over A. And also, for the current, we need I equals voltage over resistance. So to calculate the resistance, we need the area and the length of the wire and the, res the resistance of nichrome. So the resistance of nichrome we can find from the book, which happens to be... 1.5 5 times 10 to the negative 6. Negative 6. This can be found on page 721. The area equals. So we can. They give us a diameter over here. Let's say 0.6 millimeters. So using that, we can find out the cross-sectional area of pi, half of a uh, 0.6 is 0.3 for the radius, since they give us the diameter, and millimeters r times 10 to the negative 3. So we square that radius to, oh, undo that. So we square that radius to get there. Cross section area, and the length of the wire equals 90 centimeters, which equals 0 0.9 meters. So we plug everything into the equation the first one and we get resistance equals 1.5 times 10 to the negative 6 times 0.9 divided by the area which is pi 0.3 times 10 to the negative 3 and if we find want to find out, this gives us the resistance of the wire. So once we found out R, we stick it in the final formula, which wouldn't be equals not equals, <laughs> but we put in our final. And then we put in our final formula, R equals change in voltage over resistance, so change in voltage will give us 6.5, and if we stick whatever we just did on the calculator, and see if you can beat me to it, so 1.5 times 10 to the negative 6, times 0.9, Divided by times point three and then negative three squared. We got that squared. We get a four point seven seven yields you to the final answer of
1.4.